Could you introduce yourself to the Bloop audience? Hey, what's up, Bloop? Um, I'm in here with Living Legends. I represent Hieroglyphics, Souls of Mischief. I'm A, motherfucker plus. Hieroglyphics, Souls I said this the other night on my Instagram Live. By the way, my Instagram Live sucks. Cause only, nah, nah. cause I'm only followed by Struggle Ground Hip Hop fans, and they don't really fuck with me, cause, because Struggle Ground Hip Hop, Struggle Ground Hip Hop is a white man's game. You gotta feel it, and you they don't fuck it. with me. No, you gotta feel this, cause you you understand this dichotomy. Like we were on tour, all together, like five of your peers, five of my peers. More than that, it was in, it was. Do you know what year it was? It was 1998. Nah, I ain't even talking about that. I'm talking about. Oh, which one? Oh, you talking about when y'all was on y'all struggle tour? You know this when we uh -oh. popped on and it was like AC alone. You know he he, ignored, he he ignored it when I said it was on a struggle tour. Did you? Did I? Was it a struggle tour? Uh -oh. yeah, but but I get paid. It's I know you get paid. Was it a struggle tour? Um, I think every tour is a struggle. No, every tour is not a struggle. I know you've been on some live, act nigga. You was on tour with Tribe Called Quest, right. De La Soul, The Alcoholics, and y'all open in this building. And I was at the show. I was in the crowd. What happens in that stays in that? Because I hear you. oh, that's real. Get the fuck out of here. We're doing interviews. Get the fuck out of here. That sounds spot. I ain't sunspot. He don't, he don't talk like that. All right. Anyway. Niggas is acting like we're not in here doing like, work. What we about. Okay. Oh, you're right. What happens on tour stays on tour. Uh, yeah, Except yeah. for herpes. All right, now look. Didn't so, uh, okay. so look. Glad I didn't because. Because that's going on. It's going on. Years, you, oh, yeah, you should go raw on the road. Nah, but I'm 43, bro. Like, no. <laughs> you never went raw on the road? Mm. <laughs> he asked her for us. <laughs> So, man, it <laughs> got quiet. Now, look, bro, no. I'm going to tell this story. I didn't know. Look, <laughs> I was on Telegraph Ave when, when the first time I came up here to the Bay Area. That, that was like 80. Uh, no, he said 80. Well, I was even born in the 80s. So, look, so I'm a 90s baby. I was born in 1991. It had to be a threshold. I was born in 1991. So, anyway, I came up here to the Bay, and um, Sunspot <laughs> took me out to the Ave, and he's like, there was, a, there was this uh, this young man right here, because he was a young man. And I didn't know, I didn't know what he looked like. I actually heard your music before because uh, my boy Todd that I used to run around with, he used to uh, fuck with this girl from L.A. that um, used to fuck with Tajay. And then, um, and then... No, wait, listen. No, no, no. I'm not going gonna, 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 gonna to bring all that up because it happens. So I... Exactly. We got a tape and Burnt was on it, and I was like, "Ooh, these niggas can rap. Like that shit is tight." I heard Burnt, and I was like, like "I was like, oh." Like, like no, but I mean, not aside from him. I, I ain't gonna bring that up because I can put him on blast. Because uh, you, y'all know Cleophis. Cleophis, that's different. You knew Cleophis with the Birkenstocks. All right, anyway, I I forgot to say. But look. We went out to Telegraph, and there was a young man outside who may or not been standing on the corner, not really selling tapes. He was um, distributing some things that people like to smoke, let's just say. Let's just say. Wellness. Wellness. He was giving out that medicine on the avenue, and he was like on, on, on wax back then. Uh, I don't think it was on wax. By a tape. Or you was on Dale shit on the B side. You was on the B side. You was on wax, nigga. High school was like. So you was in high school on wax. You know how small your mind be. Like I'm like I'm on wax, but it only pertain to the girls I can fuck at my school. So I'm like. Skyline got a lot of hoes. <laughs> Whoops, I didn't mean hoes. I meant women. No, if you got the pool, then I could do that. I think I know all your verses. How about that? Mm. Back, back to how much of a hustler I was back in the day. Sit down. He was out there working. I mean, I'm an Aries, so you gonna, you're going to feel that. And he showed love. Hey, hey, but you know what, like, instantly, it's the whole thing about it. Not everybody did. But you know what I like about being here with you on doing this? And this is, this is sitting back to your Insta. It's like, when you said that shit, What's Insta? it's like, you're going to feel my philosophy on this. Niggas like us need witnesses. You feel me? You think we crazy. For right? things but the thing about it is, like, we crazy because motherfuckers be changing and we be the same. We be the same. And motherfuckers be like, you tripping for being the same and then make you seem... They don't understand. 
But, but, but the whole thing about it is that's where witnesses come in. And crews need niggas like us and like myself, you, and Cash to make sure that niggas don't get mashed on. And, and, and that part. Like, because hey, I plea was a, if you want to talk about souls and Hyro, uh, plea and, uh, and Cash, well, Cash is younger than us. But plea, plea, was, plea, was, a, plea was a street cred. I, I mean, I was. We was. I was out there. He, was, he, was, he wasn't even rapping about it. He was just. Doing I was it. poor, trying not to be poor, and I know people smoke weed. Made sense. Made sense. And and I could battle motherfuckers on Telegraph and sell and weed. And sell them weed after you serve them. Man, yeah. It's a win-win. Yeah. I mean, speaking of battling I, I people, was a nickel and dime motherfucker. But like back then, for a poor motherfucker. I didn't see who who, who rich. You know what I mean? Like Okay, what about oh, can we can we talk wait? Like, I was poor before that. When where did y'all record taxi? Taxi. Hey man. It's called Cat Fair. I know nigga. It's called Taxi because that's the name of the symbol, nigga. No, we, it's we, called Taxi because I called it that shit. Probably like Dell like Dell House or something. Who made the beat? Oh, 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 oh. Hey, We're standing with one of the best. Like real, like more like. What, like? Like yeah, nigga, you know you made some of the biggest beats of hip hop ever. Everybody know that shit. No, they don't. They don't at all. No, because you never flew that fucking. I'm the nigga. I'm the nigga that make the beat flag. I actually went opposite and made sure that I wasn't like seen like nothing, so we could all be a group and be a strong force. And so I did that. that. I, but but that's on my mom. It's a fault though, nigga. You need to let niggas know that you the nigga. You made fucking ninety three to infinity. To this day, that's your biggest song. You know that. And you made that shit. I was bitter about that shit for a while. Uh -oh. But then it started like making money, and it's like twenty years later. That's a cool song for people to put on commercials. Oh, uh, nigga, that's on the NBA Finals. This shit now. And and and, and the fucking standing cup. Oh. Feel me? Cause, Cause that multiply the check, but like that, kind that of part that take a motherfucker bitterness away. It's like, it's like the, it's like, like you know how people be like, wait, justice, what will come to light and all that shit. I'm like, like why, like when I play the background for some cool shit, motherfuckers push me to the background and like, uh -oh. yeah. and and and. and, and, and and I ain't talking about high roll now. Well, I'm just talking about like 20 years later. I'm like, I'm not saying I did myself a disservice by not promoting myself so much, but I did. Me too. But I changed all that when the checks start coming in for the beat, and I'm like, God is good. And, and the cream, the cream will always rise to the top. Man, man. But I, why you know what? What? I'm lying. I bet the money don't. What are the biggest? What are your five biggest beats? Name the song. My, These might not you know you produce. Oh man, I only got five things that's like ever went like nationwide. So well, like, what are they? Uh, you made what beat? You made Catfish. Dylan, Dylan. <laughs> 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 but only on your show, on your show on, three. Um, like yeah, you know, like I'm like you know, I'm an underground motherfucker, but I didn't even know we could. It was my escape from a horrible life. When I seen it can make money, I'm like, oh, but by that time I was a hip hop nigga. Nah, so but you loved it too. Um, that's, this is a masterful portrayal of deflection. Okay. You know what I'm saying? So, what are the songs? Stop. Come on, yeah. say what they right, um, 93 Till. I did 93 Till. Um, Cab Fair. Yes. Um, I did The Life for Mystic. Wow. That was a big that's song. That's the fucking beat. I did Soweto um, featuring oh. Guapale. That, and yeah. we put out Guapale first joint. Like, shout out Guap the Queen. I used to go out with her. And, and, um, and, um. Shout out to Guapale. Bro, man. I had, yo, man, I'm, I'm, I'm so glad that that shit ended Guap because. I was, yeah, it didn't go nowhere. It was by default because her homegirl, um, actually her homegirl, her homegirl Katie. She's the one that made us a fine grouch because we, we were coming back from Europe. We'd had no place to stay. And she's like, hey, my friend Corey, he got a room. He got a couple rooms for you guys in Alameda. And then we went there and he was grouchy. He was a grouchy ass dude. And we named, we named him the grouch. On us, man. But like, them motherfuckers. Anyway. Y'all was dope when we was whack. That's why I tell Oak. Hey, wait, wait, see that shit. Why you tell Oak that? Because y'all was dope when we was whack. But see, I, I, I look at the whole shit like we all there. We all dope. We all trying to get better. You niggas have record deals. No, 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 if no, you no, really no, don't, no, why ain't you signed yet? Man, hey, yeah, you made niggas feel so bad. You know what that was for, though? 
to make us feel bad? No, you're making struggle rapper niggas feel bad. Hey, look. You know how many nights I cried off of that line? Come on, man. Yeah, my mouth's not yet. Nah, I'm lying, nigga. I wanted to be. Like, listen, I got it. I see you don't say that no more. I'm going to say it. The reason I said it, when I wrote that rap, because the in, and the industry was a good old boy club. Rap niggas around the block that that it was like you'll never get signed. We'll get signed before you did. Like two motherfuckers around the block from 82nd and MacArthur in East Oakland. Uh oh, you know that's why I didn't so rather I take my deal. I was like, ah, if you really dope, why ain't you signed yet? But uh, I never had an album out, so every nigga who wasn't signed, it was like it was coming in a nigga like. What yo, 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 I mean, like, niggas, motherfuckers who out now, like, Talib was like, yo, I'm getting a deal. You know what I mean? It's that kind of shit. I'm, I'm like a motherfucker, like, from the block that's like, these niggas over here that was hating from third period. You feel know I me? Mean? Like, my, in our little ass, like, when you young like that, you don't got no perception outside. I was like a forward thinking motherfucker. I was in Berkeley and Hayward. Like, I was, you know, I was trying to get money. I was poor at home. So I tried to go. No, even in that small ass shit, I was talking about two niggas who said some shit to me that I was like, yeah, nigga. Was you in the house when Freestyle Fellowship came up here and y'all had that battle? And, and uh, were, you in, were you in that apartment? Yeah. It, was that Domino's apartment? Yeah. Is that where it happened? I was there. All right, who won? But, but the whole thing about. Uh, what happened? What, who won? Man, I love. I heard, I heard the story. The who won? It was a close event. I wish there was a camera. Uh, uh, this is a lot of people don't know, and, I, and there's certain shit I can't disclose. I know, there were ahead. two people there that were independent of either one of us, okay. and they were to decide who, who they felt won. Okay. And they the only people who know. Ooh. Well, I've heard some people's accounts of that. Yeah, and, uh, and let it be told, man. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? But I heard it's kind of even. All that being said, what it really I heard there was no clear winner. Yeah, that's that's what I heard. I want that shit to happen now. That shit should happen nowadays. Nah, nah, man, man, we we comrades now. I know, but just for the competition. Nah. Well, just I want to battle everybody in my crew just to serve niggas up, cause yeah, cause I'll serve all them niggas. Folks. I know, and I did that, and I'm serving them niggas. Right. But, but like, you really going? I love them, but I'm serving. You know, I love them. Serve them is good love, I, tough love. I love you when I have love in my heart, and when I don't got love in my heart, I still like you. I was trying to be on your show. I this made this shit up. This dude is the best. He the best. I, I love you three. Wait, 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 wait. One, real quick, real, real quick. Shit. One more thing. I know, get used to it, but I, this. I got to. Nigga, this is the third This. Time. I got one more question. What's next? No, Wait, what's next? I, I, damn, you talking about I, sex? Damn. I'm on your show, motherfucker. See, I'm trying to keep it PC. I don't want to bring y'all. I don't, I don't know y'all situations married, at home. I get to see. Like this. Oh. Cause he's talking about the old shit. That's old shit. You can't get mad, nigga, about old shit. Niggas been around the block. Every encounter is something to cherish. 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 How the kid? How's your kid doing, man? Is your kid like taller than you and playing basketball, dunking on you? Oh man. Uh oh. Yeah, I can't. Did he still? Did he try to steal on you yet? Man hands. Uh oh. Grown man strength. Not even strength. It's called. He's stronger than me, but he ain't. Oh. But he ain't old as me. He don't know yet. It don't work. His muscles ain't. They don't know yet. Oh, he ain't yoked. He ain't yoked nobody up yet. I love him, and he make he make heat. Oh, uh, he, he's like, yeah, bro. He play three instruments. He get straight A's. He's like, Whoa. he look better than me because his mom's pretty. And Damn. I love you, an ugly I'm nigga. Like, man, I love. Him. I know. It's good because yeah, ugly people make pretty children. Yeah, I mean, I'm like <laughs> fucking ugly, bro. Like, yeah, I'm the type of motherfucker that never got no. Like, I'm in souls of mischief. I'm some fine motherfuckers, bro. Like, bro. <laughs> You said they so fine. You better just put up a He said I'm in fourth and this is all the business. He called them five. He said, damn, he then, said they're five. And, 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 and oh, he's cute. He's cute. He said dashing. He's cute. Like, I'm, I'm cute. Like, you feel me? He's all light skinned motherfuckers, man. <laughs> See, dark skin niggas unite. We back in style. Oh, wait, because when Soul started, dark skin niggas was not in style. I keep everything. So I'm Jamaican, man. I'm in style all the time. Jamaican, and I am that. Jams pack, because my jam, van pack, because my jams pack. Like, even Get the, the peanut line, butter. We invented treasure. Was, that's like Jamaican, Stop you with my feature for making. On the same block, casual block, Tajay block, everything. You walk in my house, it's Jamaica. It is. I, I tell them, like, you talk to my grandma, I, I was like, just smile and nod. They be like, what the fuck? She said, I'm like, bruh, smile and nod. 
was it. When you see yourself smiling, and be like, <laughs> yes, yes, thank you, yeah. That's it. And if you interview any one of these niggas, why'd you never do a reggae album? Because but I'm because I'm I'm a, I'm a yank. I'm, I'm first buying a farm. I was raised in East Oakland. Okay. The only time I even talk any like kind of patois at all is in Jamaica. Around my all right, let me hear it. Let me hear it now. Do it. Go there. I'm from East Oakland. Do it. Give me the yeah. patois. Tell me, nigga. Yeah. I, nah. <laughs> this nigga, you are, I love you, A+. I love you. Ah, for real.